What's going on guys? So I'm over here at my tuner's house, or Derek, for everybody who wants to know his actual name, aka know that. the young Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> About to head out and take this truck to the shop. <laughs> you guys have seen this truck on the channel a couple times. And need some more updates to do more shenanigans. Mainly safety stuff. The tracks won't let me run there anymore. Yeah. Even if we slow down, we're still illegal. So <laughs> it's too fast. It. Yep. So. so we're gonna drop this off and pick up another car, correct? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We're getting a new car for my wife. She's uh, selling the Evo over there, unfortunately, and uh, we're gonna get her a. She didn't really need a street car, so we're getting her an actual race car, doing a whole new setup and everything. So. Sweet. I don't know if we're doing live or another video or something, but you guys will see what that is yeah so basically this video is gonna be we're gonna go to the shop hang out talk about what's going on and then film the process of picking up the other car yep. or a new project basically yeah I don't think anybody well some people know about it but I think for the most part it's kind of a secret yeah I don't know what it is either so I'm just along for the ride <laughs> so, I got new tires for any of the for anybody blue that we come across for anybody who wants to get gapped on some hard tires <laughs> calling you out right now not good hard tires <laughs> Ah, I got pulled over. They actually gave me a ticket for having slicks. I've never actually seen anybody get a ticket for illegal tires. Yeah. But, so we had to put these on. Let's yep. See how they do. So we're going to head out. It's about an hour drive up north. And it's going to be pretty fun in this thing that sounds like it's knocking. It's going to be like two hours <laughs> of knocking. <laughs> oh, man. drive kind of slow. All right. Let's do it. Sorry, I got pulled over yesterday for riding, or two days ago, for riding dirty in the cobalt. <laughs> yeah. Give me no. Doesn't sound that bad. Oh, it's just when you cruise, huh? The yeah. knock. Or yeah. once it warms up. Yeah, this is not. I mean, this is just normal noise from it being cold. It gets really bad out there. Yeah. Sometimes. Other times, I'll be. Oh yeah, you like that? I went all the way down to four. <laughs> uh, back up to eleven. Control you. It'll come back. Down. Ten psi. So that's uh, the other. Where the heat is at. <laughs> I haven't driven on these tires either to see if we were actually able to balance them well. Oh. Uh, the wheels are a pain in the ass to balance because they have that little floating center. Floating? Oh, yes, yeah, so you can't. They're not always perfect. Yeah. So it'll probably be a little shaky. So we just got over here to Boris shop. Torque Automotive. Yep, over here in Aurora, right? Yep, Aurora, Colorado. His last name actually is Torque. Yeah, but not Pretty spelled like. Destined, destined to be uh, yeah. in the cars. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, T-O-R-K. So what's all going on? The updates for the truck, AKA, well, AKA 
Liam Neeson. Some Liam action. Some Liam Neeson. Yeah, wasn't too bad of a drive. It was a little warm, so we had to had to stop. Truck did great all year, so like it did the time goal that we wanted, and uh, but we're just leaving so much on the table with how much the converter slipping. So that's one of the main things we gotta get the converter in there. Uh, possibly then, another motor, huh? Possibly another motor possibly with that knock. Motor. I mean, hey, it's still it's still ticking, literally. Yeah, but the cage is a big thing. So I mean, everybody was really nice last year. Pueblo let me run all the time as long as I only went eighth even though we were slowing down. We let out at the eighth, get on the brakes hard, and it'd still be illegal for not having a cage. Yeah. But, so we gotta put something in there. Um, so we're probably just gonna do a 10 point so that we can be legal to slow down. <laughs> so a 10 point? Yeah, 10 point converter, and then maybe some miscellaneous little things. Just wrap up, but that's really all it needs. I mean, it did it did great last year. We're happy with the suspension, we're happy with the way it was leaving. We still got some, some shit to learn, that's for sure. But we need more power, but there's no more power in the turbo. We've got it all the way up, all the boost that it'll do. And we're only putting down about 700. But we know based on fuel consumption that it's doing a lot more than that. Yeah. I mean, we're just, only getting a 400 RPM drop if we shift at 65 pounds. Yeah, range. and it just stays it's pegged up top much. like it's just slipping. Yeah, I mean, I, like, I'm in third for three, like, three and a half seconds before the eighth. I mean, it's just, it's acting, and it, with 355 gears in it. It's just acting like it's uh, like sleeping really bad. Yep. So hopefully that'll help. It'll hopefully show, we put the new converter in and then we see a power increase on the dyno. And then hopefully, yeah, we'll have more power. Yeah. Because before it was only Film doing, that and do some testing. Yeah. See if it makes, see if it makes that, that 1200 horsepower that I've seen on, on, on YouTube. Based on, <laughs> based on fuel consumption, it's not making 1200 in any way, shape or form. And it sure as hell isn't putting it down to the wheels. But, uh, yeah, we gotta just do those things, and hopefully we'll get more than a 14 mile an hour back half. <laughs> it's pathetic. Especially on these sexy ass hard tires. Them hard tires? No, I, I, I can't. I can't compete with Zach in the hard tire. <laughs> now, I mean, we're not gonna change the tire unless we absolutely need to. It'll stay on the 28 by nine, which is a little bit smaller than all the guys that would be racing. So just some minor updates for the season. Yeah, try to take a little bit of weight out of it to compensate for the cage, but there's just not a whole lot of weight to take out. Like, I don't know where the weight is in this truck. It weighs 3350 with me in it. And I just don't know where the hell it is. <laughs> should have bought an RX-7. Yeah, maybe I should have. But then I get gapped by trucks like this. Shit. I don't know about that. Don't where, know about that. What are we racing? We... Are doing another bet or something? Yeah, I'll probably lose another 100 bucks. And we haven't even raced it. No, yeah, we just bet dinner, huh? Bet dinner. Okay. Eh, maybe we'll bet a hundred bucks. But the thing, though, right? Because if I lose, mm -hmm. I'm just gonna be like, "Damn tuner, you sabotaged my tune." I'll show you exactly what's going on in it. Nah, I feel like I don't know. But that's the thing, though. Is like, if I lose a hundred bucks to my tuner and I race with my tuner, I feel like that could be sabotage, like that. Or, or you can view it as a as a win-win. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> It's all right. I ain't scared. No, I wanted to race it. I wanted to race you on the on the 150 shot when you were just on gate, but that never happened. I'm pretty sure you get me hard. I do. I was fine with it. We could have done it. I don't know. Why yeah, I don't remember what happened. To it. But, but yes. So we are waiting on a friend with a truck and trailer. Yeah, Kenny, a friend of ours, is coming out uh, to pick us up and take us to go get the other car. Yep. He's dropping his car off, and then we're gonna pick up the car and drive all the way back down to the springs. Yep. Yep. So we'll. Get that truck and trailer. Maybe get some food, yeah? Yeah. I'm starving, maybe. I'm not starving, but I'm a little hungry. Um, so, get that truck and trailer and then show you guys this dope ass Civic that he's gonna be getting. Tradition or what? Yep. Yeah, so. I need to remember the little things. I don't know the little things I need to do.